What's good YouTube? It's your boy Tony D2 Wild checking in once again back at it like a motherfucking crack addict today with a very special vid. Now guys, I got an unboxing at my mama's house and somebody's calling me right now. I don't know why. I got an unboxing at my mom a box at my mom's house that I need to go pick up and unbox. And that's a good 15 minute drive. So I ain't got to do that much talking, man. We got some special stuff in from Chance Sports. Let's get straight to it, man. Let's get it. Hip hop, sip pop, run up. Hip hop, yeah. She suck my dick in my flip flopper. I do not fuck with no hip hop. Rappers, oh, I'm a dog. Bitch, I don't text. Cause I can't spare the thing I wanna say. I don't know you. So, as you can see, man, there was a package actually sitting outside of my mom's house. Now, that's not actually the package that I was going to pick up. The package I was going to pick up was actually inside of the house. However, my secret passageway to getting inside my house is no longer available. My mom locked it up. And uh, yeah, so I have to actually go back home either to tomorrow or I don't know, I'm going back later on the night to go pick that up and pick up some more like packages I have that's inside of the house. But we do have a package here from Champs. I don't know what it is, what it could be. I, I have no clue what's going on now. Um, but it's always good to have a surprise unboxing. It could be something crazy, like some crazy, crazy shit, or it could be some damn sock darts, whoever. You never know at Champ Sports. I'm always blessed at the end of the day for, for, the, for the sneakers being seated to me. It's always a blessing, so either way, this is uh, pretty interesting. We're about to head over back to my old apartment now. I unfortunately left my fucking keys. I don't have my keys to get into my apartment. However, Jesse has some packages for me, so we're gonna go pick up these packages from him and uh, then head back to the crib and um, right now I'm borrowing uh, Nikki's car. Nikki doesn't live that far from me so I'm able to just easily have her like, come give me the car and you know keep it moving but uh yeah man we better go pick it up and then head back to the crib and check it out there. Guys, man, you know what's been bothering me the most about not having my car? Is the amount of disrespect I've been getting on the freeway. I've been getting so much disrespect from people that are not even worthy, bro. I'm talking about V6 chargers, Hemi chargers, challengers with no badges on them. You know, there's straight disrespect. Mustangs with the... With, with the with the 5.0 liter whatever you know 5.0 GT V6 you know they just they just going by youping around me some of the dudes even looking at me grinning you know what I'm saying like really just showcasing themselves man if only I had my motherfucking car they would all be dusted the good thing about a Challenger Scat Pack is that uh pretty much it can dust pretty much any it can pretty much dust the 5.0 it can pretty much it can dust the 5.0 for sure yeah it can dust I think up to a Z1 on a Camaro anything below a Z1 um anything below a Hellcat on a Charger Challenger and uh yeah it's it's it's, it's like a bigger bro it's like the middle child but he has like it's like like Leang Leangelo like Lamelo is like the little guy you know Lonzo you know Hellcat even though some of you guys are gonna talk shit about the Ball Brothers already I so saw maybe that wasn't a good analogy but the Scat Pack is a big boy it's a baby Hellcat man and I just miss him I miss him I know I know I've been mentioning it it's it's just three weeks is starting to really hit me hard I'm starting to get really weak man I need my shit by the end of this week Nicole's birthday is at the end of this week so we got a lot of stuff uh, in store man for you guys on that. And uh, we'll just go from that. Look at this stingray, god damn. That bit look nice. But uh, yeah man, we're headed back to the crib. We probably might grab a bite to eat and then get straight to this unboxing. Or, or I might just get straight to the unboxing. I, I don't know. Let me just figure out what's going on. Nikki's at my house right now because I just borrowed, I borrowed uh, her car. So, you know, we're just figuring that out once we get there and see what she wants to grab something along with us. So, yep. Guys, before we get into this video, man, the subscriber of the day goes to Antoine Frazier, man. You shot you home. You're one of the first subscribers on this channel. When I go to my page, I'm able to go see like who the first person is, the oldest subscriber. You, I believe you are maybe the first one, if not the top 10, top 30. Antoine, shout out to you, bro. You've been on this channel since 2000 and what, I would say 14? You, you are old, OG on the channel. You have, you've seen the growth. I appreciate your love. I appreciate your su support. Antoine Frazier, you are the subscriber of the day. 
Also, guys, I had to stop and like while I'm editing this video right now to let you guys know that I have not forgotten about you guys on the Stock X giveaway. I'm just waiting on Stock X to hand over the credits to give to one of you guys. I'm waiting, I'm waiting, I'm telling them, I'm bucking. I'm just waiting on them, you know what I'm saying, to give me the credits so we can go ahead and hand out to one of you guys the winner. So if you have not already entered, you still can go enter now on that Stock X video. Go check the video out, watch it, and follow the rules. It's very simple. And uh Fuck. You know, you can go check that out. I have not given away the, the sneaker yet, the, the credits yet to that winner. So I'm waiting on them. Once I get that, I will be making sure to announce it in an upcoming video. You just need to be tuned in because I'm not going to put a winner announcement, stock it, blah, blah. You just got to be tuned into the channel, man, to catch these giveaways. Also, I have another giveaway coming in, st in st uh, store soon on, you know, something else with Champ Sports. And I have another giveaway with a special person. Like I said, uh, as time will go on, we'll get more into depth on that. But I also just want to say thank you to everybody on the kind words you've been saying over the channel these past few days. And once again, I just want you guys to know that, man. It means a lot. And it's very uplifting when you guys are in tune with the channel. Just present positive. I, I, I work off, like, we work hand in hand. You know what I'm saying? When you guys are happy, I'm happy. When you guys are pissed, it affects me. So. The, the, I'm reading all the good comments, the bad comments. I'm just blocking niggas and, and getting the shit out of here. So I uh, really appreciate everybody, all the support, all the love. And, uh, yeah, man, I'm just feeling good, man. So, yeah, let's get straight to the unboxing. I'm done talking. Let's get it. All right, guys. So, man, we finally made it back to the crib, and we got an unboxing here from Champs. Like I stated, this might be what I expected to be. However, it may not be what I expected to be. I don't honestly know because my mother, my, it's all on you, mom, at the end of the day, if you was telling the truth or not. She said I had another box there. So, and this does feel pretty light to be what I think it is, but at the same time, you just never know. Let's see. I think this is it. All right, guys. So, all my top 10 releases for, I believe, November. Uh, I did earlier this month. If you haven't seen it already, make sure you check it out. This was... Not one of my top sneakers. Um, the one that dropped before actually was. I, I, I said it was a good sneaker. I just said it reminded me too much of a previous one. And this is it. The Jordan 12. I don't know if they're calling this the cool gray or the gray. I don't know. It's like a cool gray Jordan 12. And this is set to release this upcoming Saturday. And it looks a little bit better in person than I thought. Okay. So here are the shoes right here. One main difference that I did not know that on this sneaker that I see now is that it has a midsole that is also gray. It's like a light gray midsole. I thought that the midsole itself was white or like an off-white or a cream. However, it is of a light gray and the suede is very good. The same type of suede as on the Burgundy Wine 12. Me personally, I really like the sneaker. It looks good. I just thought that owning, you know, a cool gray 8 or owning the, even the, the other 12 that just released, it was this uh, double up of a different colorway. You know what I'm saying? If you need a gray sneaker, this is a good one to go. I know they released the uh, 12 low and all gray last year. That would be another reason why. Very similar to that of like how the um, Jordan 11s dropped and then the Jordan 11 low uh, gum bottom last year dropped. Very similar colorways dropping once again. So overall though, it is a dope sneaker. The quality is great. It's the same type of quality that's on the 12 that released. And uh, you won't be disappointed if you're looking for an all-gray sneaker. However, I feel like this may be more so on a pass. But, hey, we're going to get the review out ASAP, Rocky. So stay tuned on that. And a uh, huge shout out to Chansport once again for showing love and support. This is my first ever unboxing on the channel. Uh, guys, we got some major stuff coming in hand. I'm going to have a review out on these most likely by tomorrow. And I have a vlog, too. So... Maybe two double uploads. I don't know. I might be streaming as well. Just, just stay in tune, guys. Just stay in tune. I really appreciate all the love and support that you guys been showing to me on the channel. And the the, the, the future's bright. Future is bright. So, guys, whenever you have a uh, setback, it's always set for a major comeback. You feel what I'm saying? Huge shout out to champs. Huge shout out to you guys. I love you guys. It's your boy Tony D2 Wild. I'm checking in. I'm checking out. Peace. A broke nigga believe anything, a rich nigga tell him And a goddamn J by anything a nigga sell him A money hungry bitch and fuck for a cool honey Rapping jeans on my head, cause a cool have a onion Tell him what they wanna hear, tell him what they wanna hear Everything for sale over here, that what they wanna hear Tell him what they wanna hear, tell him what they wanna hear He's everything for sale over here, that what they wanna hear Man, do what they want, boys, do what you let them
nigga believe anything that you tell him I might let anybody pet him And the rich will buy whatever you sell him If it's sweet, you finesse him A bitch gon' be a bitch like a hoe gon' be